hold the gold medal at 74 kilos. A 2021 Hello. continental champion, Timura Salkazanov, Slovakia, Frank Chimizo, the four-time European champion for Italy. It was Salkazanov who knocked off Chimizo last year at these European championships. And off the mat they go, feet to back. Referee says four, and it's confirmed. Chimizo launching the opening salvo. Salkazanov is saying, I stepped out first. And if you're Slovakia, you hate to use a challenge this early, 20. Not even 20 seconds, yeah, 22 seconds in, and they are going to use it, and I don't blame them. I mean, if you thought it was the step out before the four, you'll give up the one. And a critical early challenge here in this gold medal match. I think they're saying Frank Chimizo's foot, that right foot is, that's so tough to see Jury in real time. Challenge decision. During dynamic wrestling, blue can step out. Action continue, four point by blue. Challenge lost. An early blow for Slovakia. Salkazanov loses the challenge. Center, blue. Chimizo gets the feet to back four and the lost challenge point. So Chimizo goes up five, nothing. But I can tell you what Salkazanov is not going to do. He's not going to panic. He's been in this position before, down against Frank Chimizo by five points. So he knows he can come back because he's been here before. Yeah, it's almost like deja vu, isn't it? With what we saw a year ago. Blue, no fingers. Blue. Action blue. So Kazanov controlling the mat. By that we mean his back is the one in the center. Chimizo heels near the edge. He'll reposition himself, get back. Front and center halfway through period one. Chimizo with the big four point throw. A five nothing lead. For as good a year Salkazanov had in 2021, he came up just short of the Olympics at the last chance qualifier with a third place finish. A world championship runner up, losing to Dake of the United States, a European championship, and he came up just shy in the last chance Olympic qualifier. And I had an opportunity. So Kazanov oh. able to get oh. the two on the edge. Inside a minute to go, his first offense. And I asked him to start the year, what was that like after falling one match short of reaching the Olympic Games. And what did you do after? And he said, well, for me, it was right back to work because there's my coach and I have the understanding that you have to earn days off. And I fell short of my ultimate goal of reaching the Olympic Games. So there were no days off because I didn't earn it. So I got right back to work. How about that mindset? That's what makes him so special. Step out point, Chimizo that time lost track of where he was along the edge, so a point given, and it's 5-3. And here we go, Salkazanov slowly getting back into this match. He is just so poised. Nothing rattles him. The more you watch him, even keel. Doesn't show a lot of emotion, and after three minutes, Chimizo with a two-point lead. There is the great Frank Chimizo. Fifth at this recent Olympic Games in Tokyo. He went two and two in Japan. 
This was the four point throw very early on. 22 seconds in. Precise timing by Chimizo, and then back comes Salkazanov near the edge. He gets his takedown. He adds a late step out point, and he is right back in it, trailing 5 3. Chimizo, after he got knocked out by Salkazanov in the Europeans last year, came back, finished third at the championships. Again, he had won the European title in both 19 and 20, bronze medal in 2018 as well. Wrestled for Cuba his first few years, then made the switch to Italy, immediately brought success to the country. Has not stopped ever since. He brought home the championship, the world title, the first of two. Consider the greatest Italian wrestler of all time. Frank Chimizo with a two point lead trying to add another European championship Blue, to his belt. Action Blue. Action Blue. Blue. In Cuba, probably shooting themselves in the Blue. foot now after Blue. kicking Frank Chimizo Blue. off the team. He was living on the streets. Transferred to Italy, and you mentioned it. One of the best Italian wrestlers of all time. And also, if you're another Cuban wrestler that transferred from Cuba to Italy, Abraham Cognito Ruano. And that's, he's not off, he's not talked about enough either. When you think about Italian wrestling, a lot of people mention Frank Chimizo. Everyone ma mentions Frank Chimizo. But Abraham Cognito Ruano was a bronze medalist at the Olympic Games behind Abdul Rashid Sajalayev and Kyle Snyder. Yeah. He arrived in Italy 2015. Very similar path, as you mentioned, that Chimizo took. So Kazanov has added a point with the activity clock, so now it's down to one, and we're down to inside a minute. Gold medal on the line at 74 kilos. Chimizo has hooked up one shot, and he hit it. He hit it big time, a four-point throw. Needs to reposition as he works near the edge. Wisely, the veteran able to get back into the center. Salkazanov. Trying to find Chimizo and he disappeared and the referee is gonna stop it. And for the, gonna warn him on the circling. Back to action we go. Keep in mind, Salkazanov can only win with a takedown. A step out does not do it because Frank Chimizo has the four point move. So criteria would be in favor for Frank Chimizo here with a step out. So Kazanov digging hard, Chimizo, look at him circle his way back out of trouble and now he will go out. And the point will be awarded, just seven seconds to go. Chimizo has the four point throw. So Sal Kazanov has to keep coming. Down to five and Chimizo hooks in that arm. Sal Kazanov one last drive and he got the are you kidding? Near the edge. As time expired, he just kept the motor going, and Sal Kazanov wins. A thriller coming from behind. A few kisses to the crowd and a bow. I mean, he's remarkable. When it comes, he is, when you think of clutch wrestlers, I think of Tamara Salkazanov and Zauerbeck Sitikov, and they're both at the same weight. When you think about these comebacks, he's now defeated Frank Chimizo with a comeback win. Avtan Dil Kinchadze, who's a world runner up. Rajinbek Jamalov, okay. who's a U23 Challenge world decision. Blue step out in time, one point red. Challenge lost. Wow, stunning. They're exhausted in the bleachers for the
the second straight year, Timuras Alkazanov has won the Continental Championship. He rallies from five down again. Carbon copy of last year. 